When Matt Wilner's beetle needs some go juice, he makes a beeline for his school's cafeteria, where he taps into a mother load of crude from food. Matt has rigged up his car to run on used vegetable oil. Grease, that is. Yellow gold, fast food tea. I have two separate tanks. I have one for my petroleum or biodiesel, which I, whatever I put in there, and one here only for, for the veggie oil. Matt starts his engine on diesel or biodiesel, runs it for about five minutes to warm up the grease, then hits a switch, and he's a rolling friolator, greased lightning. So what's under the hood? Not much different. The only real difference you can see is right here, you see uh, um, my veggie oil filter. Matt spent about a thousand bucks rigging up his car this way, but now he buys only eight gallons of gas a month. So is this for everybody? It's for somebody who's willing to get their hands a little dirty. And be willing to void your warranty and skirt the law. Technically, running on grease is a violation of the Clean Air Act. But the EPA is looking the other way. After all, what comes out of Matt's tailpipe is cleaner, carbon neutral, and smells great, too. Pretty much wherever I get my oil from, I have a little scent of, where, of, of the kind of oil I get it from. And on this day, the grease bug smelled just like chicken. Miles O'Brien, CNN, Englewood, New Jersey.